Hey everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 5. So, let's continue where we left off. We are at war with both Russia and Assyria. So, this should be interesting. I don't think I want to be too aggressive, but we can at the very least pillage some of these improvements to hurt Russia at least a bit. And we can pressure St. Petersburg with our artillery. From this tile, actually. It's not a bad idea. But generally, I think we'll mostly focus on defending. And wait for them to throw some units at us. Once we kill them, we can consider going after the cities more aggressively. And let's stay out of sea bombardment range. At least for now. Grab these guys and bring them here. I queued up a lot of hospitals in most cities because we need them to reduce poverty. Poverty is getting really bad. Some cities had minus five unhappiness from poverty. So yeah, we need to solve that ASAP. Which is what we're doing. All right, anything else? What about Assyria? Let's do some damage. Let's have a look. Well, we can move up, do some damage and then back up. That will do for now. And swap some units around. Yeah, this will do. Minuteman. How about we upgrade him? Alright, we can send him this way and upgrade him a little bit. Works for me. And fortify everything else. Next. Looking fine so far. Almost lost to that one fusilier, but he's good. We are two units over our limit. Oh, no, not anymore. We just finished barracks. Also, can we buy iron from anyone? Even one will be useful. No, apparently we can't. All right, never mind then. What's the vote? Sanction Poland, Korea and Global Peace Accords. Yeah, I don't want that to pass. What's the event? Spend 375 gold and get 1000 food in the city. Which city is that? This one. What else can we do? Not a whole lot, really. Let's go for plus 1000 food. Sure, works for me. Now, let's see. We got a new archaeologist, so send him this way. And let's do some damage. First, let's back up with the wounded guy, obviously. And can we kill the Cossack? Let's find out. Maybe we can. Oh, nice, we got a new great general. That will definitely come in handy. Yep. So let's see, can we kill the Cossack? Might be hard. Yes, we can. There, he's down. And we got some golden age points, plus 50. Good start. Here's another candidate. Can't attack from this tile, I'm afraid. Well, I would like to kill him regardless. Here, no, he's not dead yet. Now he is. Okay, looks good. We might be able to kill this guy. There, so another plus 50. Or plus 35. That will do. Who's next? We got a field gun incoming. Might be a good idea to get rid of it. But let's be careful. I don't want to lose anything. Pillage. And pillage. 
And we can pressure the city a little bit. We just need to be able to see it. Okay, sure, we can do that. Here. Good enough. What about the Cossack? We can't kill it, but we can do some damage. That will do. And Assyria? Not much else we can do about Assyria. We can attack the Masked Man. Oh, he actually has logistics. Good to know. I don't like that too much. Okay, this looks fine. Let's play it safe. We are still missing Aaron, but there's just no way we can get it. Oh yeah, we lost one Fusilier. That's fine. Wait, what is he doing? He's trying to attack our coastal city. Sneaky bastard. Okay. I don't think so, buddy. Let's upgrade right away. Sneaky bastard. How about we send one more Minuteman back there? The Cossack is backing up. That's good. Let's do some more damage to the city. And pillage some improvements. The more we pillage, the better. Let's pillage as much as we possibly can. Yep. Now, there has to be a city down here. Yeah, there is. Oh, really? Okay, then. Maybe we should pressure that city. That would be so much easier, too. Yeah, this is actually a perfect target. Sounds good to me, let's do it! And promotion. No, that's just a new unit, basically. Okay. Yes, I'm sure. Anything else? Oh, that's a manufactory. We can pillage that. What do we build here? We can actually build a fort. Just in case we'll ever need it. Which we probably won't, but who knows. If we go to war with Arabia, we might. So, pillage. And we can pillage the luxury on the next turn. Works for me. So, Assyria. Let's see if we can kill something. We should be able to. Pillage. We can definitely kill this guy. Right? Yep. And move in with the Fusilier. Just be careful. Yeah, actually, move back with the wounded guy. Heal him up a little bit. I think that's it. Not much we can do with the worker. Everything we needed is already improved. Let's move into pillage that tile. That's a lumber mill, yeah? Yep. Just pillage it right away. And it looks like that will be it. Alright, next. We are at minus 18 happiness, which is not great. It might not be a bad idea to rush a few hospitals. I think we should do that. In Nimrod, for example. That city is getting a lot of unhappiness from poverty, from what I remember. Okay, we did lose some guys, but... That was to be expected when we moved in this much. Oh, Assyria actually managed to kill one. Okay. Good for you. Let's get some Golden Age points. That might not be enough. There. That will definitely be enough. Pillage and back up. So, what's the event? Public schools in all cities get plus 10% culture, okay? In the city. 
and plus 10% gold. I think I prefer gold right now, although, actually, let's go for culture, because that way we'll get an ideology faster. We can still buy a great musician. Let's buy one. Sounds good. 3000 isn't too bad. Where is he? Right here. Alright, we'll buy one. Next one is 6000. That's a little bit too much. Let's check Russia. We lost one guy right here. Yeah, the rifleman killed him. Now he will pay for it. One down. Let's pillage all of these. And we'll pressure Ekaterinburg a bit. I think that's the best way to go. They do have a Cossack inside. That's fine. I'm not necessarily planning to actually capture the city, I just want to put some pressure on Russia. Then again, I wouldn't mind actually capturing it. Okay, time to back up again. Out of range. Anything else? Yeah, pillage their luxury. Just pillage everything we can. And back up slightly. We need that Cossack to move towards us. Also, all these ships. What do you think you're doing? Can't quite kill him. There's no way they will be able to do anything. They can pillage our fishing boats. That's really about it. That's all they will be doing. Fortify. Yeah, let's back up one tile. He will not be able to attack us over there. Because there's a jungle blocking the way. And pillage all of these. I don't want to be in Moscow's bombardment range. So how about we stay out of there? We'll probably lose the cavalry. But let's try to save it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's going to die. Anything else? Not much, no. Oh yeah, we can pillage the trade route. We also still need some more archaeologists. Let's grab one real quick. And how about we rush the hospital in Nimrod? Yep, let's do it. That's four turns. And what about some other cities? Just checking how many turns we need. Nine turns. Minus five from poverty. Yeah, let's rush this one. Minus five from poverty is pretty bad. Three turns. That's much, much better. Our capital is getting minus seven. Okay. That will do. That leaves us with 100 gold. Next. Yeah, we did lose that cavalry, but I knew that's going to happen. Russia is actually sending quite a lot of units now. Okay. Let's see what we can do. First of all, let's take care of these ships, shall we? We got some promotions. Plus one range, but minus 20% ranged combat strength. I don't want that. Let's get firing doctrine, I like that one. Okay. And back up with the cavalry. This should be fine, we should be safe. This is actually getting pretty dangerous for us. Okay, should be safe to kill him. And we'll block the way. Yep, back up with cavalry again. Just move it into Nimrod or something. Yep, that's fine. 
and the back up with the other guy. So, what else can we do? Let's be careful here. I don't want to lose any more units to Assyria. We shouldn't be losing any units to Assyria. Now, back to Russia. This one will be a little bit trickier. Let's just say. Into the city you go. Well, let's back away from the city, shall we? I think we made our point quite well. Let's back up and defend. So. What do we target first? Just checking our options. I'm thinking that rifleman over there. In the middle. We can target him with multiple units. We should be able to kill him. Yeah, let's go for it. Should be doable. Let's find out. We'll have to use a fusilier, but yeah, we can kill him. There, he's down. And we can start doing some damage to the Lancer. We could almost kill the Lancer. Actually, yeah, we can kill the Lancer, but then we'll lose whatever unit moves in to kill it. So probably not a fantastic idea. Definitely not. So anything else? Let's maybe back away from St. Petersburg. We need these guys for defense at this point. We pressured the city enough. Okay, back up. But we'll stay in the general area. Just in case something funny happens. Like a raid on our capital. I could see that happening. Next. Minus 9 happiness. That's a little bit better. Should be much better once we finish the hospitals. We should be back in the positives once we finish the first round of hospitals. He's actually trying to take our coastal city. Okay, cheeky bastard. What did we lose? Yeah, okay, Assyria is actually pushing pretty hard now. <laughs> so is Russia. And look at that stack of civilian units in Moscow. These Cossacks are really getting on my nerves. We can't negotiate yet, can we? Nope, we cannot. What's our war score? Plus seven. Not too bad then. Let's do some damage. We might need a little bit of help on the coast. In form of some ranged units. Like the Masked Men. Yeah, we can send him to help. We also got a cavalry here. But we need a replacement garrison. Let's check Assyria again. Yeah, we need to back up. Let's just defend for a bit. This is too dangerous. Yeah, we'll defend for now. Back up. We can kill that guy. There, down he goes. And still attack the Lancer. Unfortunately, we don't have a follow-up. So we cannot kill the Lancer. Good enough, though. We got a great diplomat. I don't think we can get any more votes in the World Congress. And if we want any city-state, we'll need to get hundreds of influence. So that's kind of hard. Yeah, I don't think that will be happening. I'm almost tempted to send him to Sofia, honestly. I might just do that. Just to make sure we'll stay allied with it. 
Yep. So, what else can we do? Yeah, fortify until healed. We still can't negotiate. I don't think Russia is going to push. They just want her to defend their city, from the looks of it. Let's move into more defensive positions, and we'll see what they are going to do. Here, this will do just fine. We'll stay on this side of the river. If they try to push, we'll just defend. Back up one more tile, and this should be fine. Alright, looks good. Back up. Play it safe. Are we there yet? We got way too many units at this point. All these turns will be pretty damn long. Wait, what? We can get 6,754 culture immediately. Yeah, I definitely want that. That will actually give us a new policy right away. Yep, thanks. What? 7,000 turns. That's a little bit too much, don't you think? Just a little bit. Let's try a different Polish city. Maybe that will work. I'm not waiting 7,000 turns. Minus 11 happiness now. Some hospitals will be done very, very soon. Yes, Sweden is plotting against us. Probably everyone is plotting against us. Maybe except Polynesia. There are bros. So, let's see what's going on. Okay, they are actually attacking Yaroslav. And they pillaged quite a few improvements. Okay, this gives us a chance to kill more units, I suppose. Not necessarily a bad thing. One unit at a time. Some promotions. As much as I like the idea of Golden Age, we could still use some more great works. Back up slightly and just play defensively here. For now. We can almost kill that guy, but not quite. So, Russia. Yeah, I can't quite kill him. That's okay, he can't kill anyone either. Let's see what we can do about Russia. We can't negotiate yet. Well, how about we kill that wounded Cossack? Should be able to do it. Right? See, thing is, it's not exactly safe to move out of the city with the field gun. It's safer to attack the rifleman. But we can't quite kill him either. We can kill the Cossack. There, that will do. Next, this guy. We can kill him. The problem is that I might lose the field gun inside the city. But I can't really move him out of the city, so... He will have to stay inside. That's all we can really do. Yeah. I mean, two Lancers, a Rifleman and a Cossack can't actually threaten our city. But they can pillage everything around it. Just like we did with St. Petersburg. I think Assyria is backing up now. Seems that way. New Archaeologist. Let's send him west to Hanoi, although that doesn't look exactly safe. We can send him this way and give him an escort. Sounds good. Just stay on the border. We can't get an embassy, we'll just get more influence with the city-state to make sure it will stay ours. 
good enough. I think that's that. Next. We will be getting corporations Invent. soon. Awards is still available. But it's not exactly the best one. Sweden adopted freedom. Okay. Ah. So Poland went for order and Sweden went for freedom so far. We finished the hospital, that's only minus five happiness now. Much better. What can we do here? Not a lot, really. Let's go for a train station to improve production. And first, Assyria. We'll handle this real quick. Kill this guy. Can we finish him off? I suppose so, with the artillery. He's actually pushing pretty hard now. I don't like that. Let's protect our field gun. And we'll escort the archaeologist. While he does his thing. Now, Russia. Let's try to do some damage to Russia. Yeah, kill that guy. I don't like him. So, Russia. Looks like they are actually backing up now. But that can be deceiving. Let's back up ourselves with the wounded dudes. And we'll grab the Minuteman instead. Probably a good idea to upgrade him. Let's see if we can kill the Cossack. That would be nice. Can we? We might be able to. There, he's down. So that's plus 50 science and culture again. We definitely won't be killing the other one on this turn. But one step at a time. Let's block the way with our fusilier a bit. And send the field gun in this direction. And back up with the wounded fusilier. That will do. What about our coastal city? Looks like it's fine. It won't need much more help. Yeah, it's fine. We can't negotiate yet, can we? Doesn't look like it. Nope, not even with Assyria. Alright. Hopefully he will change his mind soon. I don't really want to stay at war too long, because we will start getting war weariness soon. We are already getting minus 4 unhappiness from war weariness. This will be an artifact. Oh, I think we can get a theming bonus now. Yeah, I think so. Can we? There we go, plus eight, nice. Next. Open borders. How about now? This is a pretty slow war. Wait, what? How did we lose a ship? We didn't have one. Oh no, we had a caravel on auto explored. <laughs> Alright, whatever. I don't really care about that. Oh, I can't attack from this tile. Never mind. Let's not upgrade a guy who's almost dead. We can upgrade him once he heals back to full. So let's check if we can negotiate yet. Not with Assyria, and definitely not with Russia. All right, we'll stay at war a little bit longer. I don't mind. Let's maybe move that wounded field gun out of the city. I don't feel comfortable having it over there. 
this will be much better. Another one down, good. I'm losing track how many Cossacks we actually killed. Had to be quite a lot at this point. So, yeah, upgrade. How much will that cost us? 800. Basically most of our gold at the moment. Siege free. I'm still kind of tempted to try taking Ekaterinburg. Or to try taking something, anything. I don't care which city it would be. St. Petersburg, Ekaterinburg or Moscow. Still, if Russia continues to throw Cossacks at us, I don't think we'll be taking a whole lot. Or at least, it will be kind of hard to do. Right, let's back up. Move an actual proper unit to the front. And attack from the back. Yep, that sounds like a much better idea. Back up. And move in with full health guy. Yep, nice. And we'll send a fusilier with full health. Only two more turns to finish corporations. Do your thing. What else is happening? Russia. That's actually our turn done now. Oh yeah, silver. I wouldn't mind that, yes. And also some gold. How much gold can we get from him? 18 gold per turn? Yeah, sure, that's a good deal. I'll take it. What's the military ranking now? We are seventh. And Poland is first. Yeah, that's not very surprising. They are the tech leader now. They have been the tech leader for a while. Anyway, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. So thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did, or a dislike if you didn't. And I'll see you next time.